So hey YouTube, in this video I'm going to be reviewing exactly what you're looking at. Now this cube at some points feels like it's too big to fit on the screen because it's just a huge cube. So it's a really cool cube. Um, of course it's just huge and it's perfect for anybody who wants an 8x8 in their collection. Um, so you know that's just automatically a high point about it. Just the amazingness of the fact that they can make an 8x8. And um, you know so it's just it's just awesome in all respects just to start out. Um, but it is actually an amazingly turning cube. Um, like it, it's really smooth, especially the outer layers. Like it's really, like it really feels so smooth. And I'm so impressed by Shang Chao because they just make amazing cubes, and I'm never disappointed. Yeah, it turns really well. And the corner cutting. To move on to that, it's pretty much a cubie, which is really impressive. Um, a little bit more actually. Um, yeah, almost one and a half cubies. Actually, yeah, one and a half. Not two, though. Then it just starts to fall apart. But, um, and reverse is next to nothing, but, um, it does it. So, lockups aren't really an issue, especially because solving this puzzle, unless you're somebody who does it in five minutes, you're not really going to care that much, and, you know, your time might increase by seconds, but that doesn't matter when you're solving it in, like, 15 minutes. So, um, so, yeah, it's a really... Really nice cube. It turns well. Corner cutting is great. Um, the price, of course, it's a bit pricey because it is an 8x8. So it's um, around $55. You could probably get it a little bit cheaper in some places, but I'm not sure. I think 55 is the main price for this. And I know V-Cubes just came out with an 8x8. I'm not sure what their price is. I'm just going to put it in an annotation here. Um, so yeah, I'll put it there. Or actually not an annotation, I'll just put it in the caption there, like from Movie Maker. The last thing I want to go over is the stickers, and the stickers are really nice. And so I've done, I'd say about seven solves on this 8x8, and there's no, well there's just one little peel right here. Um, the white side has one little peel. The green side um, has this peel on the corner, which is a bit annoying, but that doesn't make much of a difference. Orange is perfect. Um, blue. It's perfect, and yellow has a little peel, but really almost nothing, which is amazing. And it came with replacement stickers, so that, I don't think I'm going to be using them because they're so great. So, um, this cube holds up really well. I've gotten one pop on it, so it doesn't pop often. Um, if you go at a super speed, it might, but, um, it was easy to put back together, so... Yeah, overall it's a really great cube. Um, it's great for anyone's collection, if especially if you're a big cube fan. Um, if you're a big cube fan, I'd say definitely get this. If you have everything up to the 7x7, seven seven, I'd say definitely get this once again. Um, it's really an amazing cube. Someday maybe it'll be an, an, a WCA event, and that would be really nice. Um, yeah, so overall it's an awesome cube. You should go buy it. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching.